the analysis that I am discussing today is uh, what it would require to reach the level of greenhouse gas emission reductions that's consistent with what scientists say we need to do in order to limit global warming to two degrees Celsius or less. The major finding of our study was that emission reduction of 80% below 1990 levels is technically feasible in the United States, that this can be accomplished through multiple technology pathways, uh, that it's consistent with vigorous economic growth, that it supports uh, a level of lifestyle and consumption of energy goods and services that's similar to that of today, that maintains the reliability of the electricity system, and that doesn't require the early retirement of energy-related infrastructure and equipment. The analysis that we've done for the United States is very consistent with the analysis that E3 has also done for California, um, uh, both with regard to the long-term executive order goal of 80% reductions below 1990 by 2050, and also to the governor's, uh, Governor Brown's recently announced target of 40% below 1990 levels by 2030. Uh, and indeed, the same modeling framework, the Pathways tool, was used to look at both the U.S. and California. So there's a great deal of consistency uh, among the types of measures that are required. There are still essentially uh, three sorts of uh, uh, changes in the physical energy system that have to happen. Uh, 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 very aggressive energy efficiency, uh, the, the deep decarbonization of electric generation, and uh, the electrification of many end uses, uh, and the production of, of other lower carbon fuels for end uses that can't be easily electrified. These things that are going to be required for the United States to achieve its target are already part of the policy environment in California. California is leading the way on all of these questions. Um, the governor's um, inaugural address that spoke of uh, a reduction of co petroleum consumption by 50 percent, increasing building energy uh, 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 efficiency gains by, by, by twice, and, uh, and a 50 percent renewable uh, energy um, uh, mix in California's electricity sector. Uh, all of those are consistent with what uh, needs to happen to bring um, carbon down and achieve a deep decarbonization of the economy in the long run.